What's going on everybody? We are back in the vehicle for another In the Vehicle Impromptu video and today, today we're talking about lifetime warranties. Um, a lot of companies in the firearms manufacturing realm offer warranties on their products, some for, you know, a year, some for five years, some for 10 years, uh, some there's no written warranty like Ruger, but they'll usually take care of you, uh, and I have this experience from being a gun owner and, you know, having guns, right, but also working uh, in a gun shop and seeing the stuff that, you know, goes out and then comes back with issues or, or whatever or stuff that's working good, and uh, seeing how the companies deal with it and and how professional and quick and responsive and helpful they are, or if you're kind of screwed and now you got to go take it to Kitchen Bubba Gunsmith, you know, down the road and pay him 150 bucks to screw up your gun worse. Uh, so lifetime warranties, right? You know, the warranty on anything you want, you know, the company that produces the item to stand behind it. You know, usually a lot of the time, some of the companies with the best warranties uh, have some of the better products where, you know, they'll give you whatever warranty service you want because you're probably not going to need it. That being said, back to lifetime warranties. You know that lifetime warranties are no good if you're dead. So I hear a lot of people worried about warranty, worried about this, worried about that, a lifetime warranty. Smith & Wesson has a lifetime warranty. Taurus has a lifetime warranty. There's a lot of companies out there that have lifetime warranties. I'm sure Sky has a lifetime warranty and you're going to need it. Um, lifetime warranties, they only work if you're still living. Uh, so the moral to the story here, what I'm getting at is, A, don't let that be a deciding factor, you know, because if you're buying a reputable piece of equipment from a reputable manufacturer, uh, the warranty it will probably never be used. And in, if you have some kind of factory defect or whatever, they'll take care of it uh, at least most of the time. But lifetime warranties. I hear about it in the gun shops all the time. Oh, you need a warranty. You got to get a warranty, you know, lifetime warranty. That's And it's a selling point for a gun. But all these people that are so concerned about lifetime warranties will probably never even put more than 500 rounds through the gun in their lifetime. At the same time, a lot of these people tend to cheap out and uh, get a lesser gun because they know they're not going to use it. They know they're not going to shoot it. They know they're not going to practice with it. They know they're not going to be training or even carrying it, even though it's a carry gun and they got their carry permit. Uh, it's still going to sit at home unless they're going to the bad part of town because they don't seem to realize that crazy and evil do not have an area code. Either way, lifetime warranties. They ain't no good if you're dead. So A, make sure you're purchasing and using equipment that is up to snuff. And when you're using it, make sure you know how. Just my two cents on the matter. Anyway, everybody check the links in the description box below, especially the first three. Those are to help you get started fighting for your God-given inalienable, constitutionally protected, and reaffirmed, but inherent by birth gun rights. People without those, you got nothing else. And, uh check everything else, the link tree, the pinned comments, all that good stuff. There's discount codes. There's ways to support the channel. There's ways to check me out on all my other social media. And uh, until next time, remember...